guys it is 6 a.m. and I'm at the gym well it's 606 what am I doing here I don't know I'm just here to check out what the morning crowds like no I'm here I'm here to exercise and we'll see I'm trying to become a morning person we shall see so I ran two miles for the first time in years good stuff so now I'm gonna take my cousins to their appointment and I will see you guys later guys so you know how I started my day all amazing. I was like so excited, such a great day. So I left extra early to take my cousins and I'm driving and I'm noticing, wow, like traffic is really bad. It just wasn't moving. And normally I leave later and I actually get there on time despite traffic, but today it was just crazy. So maybe when we were like 15 to 20 minutes away, my goddaughter starts coughing and it just sounded like a weird cough. It sounded like she was choking. And I was like, oh my God, oh my God. like. I was like, are you okay, are you okay? And like, obviously I'm driving so I can't look back, but I put my hand to kind of like comfort her and I feel something wet and I pull my hand back and straight up chunky vomit on my finger. And I was like, ooh, ooh. Thank God I had a tissue near me, but still that smell and then it smell started to travel. And I had no idea because I don't have a mirror like facing them. So I didn't know like what the extent of it was, but I could smell it and I was just gagging and I had the windows down and I was just like, ugh. Like, Lord, get me to this place. So I get there not knowing what I'm expecting. I'm here thinking, man, I hope there's like a change of clothes in the bag or something like that. I open the back door and no joke, it was coming out of her nose. It was like all over, all over, all down her like pants, everything, all over. Chunky, I don't know, it looked like rice syrup or something. And I'm here trying to wipe her up and she's laughing and I'm like, Ooh, like, I mean, to hold my breath. Thank God there were enough wipes. And then there was like one change of clothes that was like super tight, but that's what we put. I was gonna take her in a diaper because literally completely drenched, drenched down to her skin. Ooh, ooh, it was so nasty. I still smell it on me. Like, ooh, so gross. Thankfully, when I got to their appointment, they gave me like gloves and all that so I could, cause I, I tried cleaning up as much as possible, but it was like there was remnants all over the car seat stuff. Ooh. And they gave me a trash bag to put her clothes in to like conceal the smell. But my car still smells like it. And I still like smell it faintly on me, even though I've washed my hands a million times. It just sucks because normally I just, like, I'll shower after I take them. And today I showered because I went to gym. I showered before and I was like all fresh and clean and now I feel nasty, but I don't have time to shower. I had to get yesterday's vlog uploading, which I did. I uh, packed some snacks and I already had my lunch ready to go. So yeah. I'm gonna head to work now and I will see you guys later, but that was my morning. So I got out of work early, super awesome. Now I'm gonna go to my sister's house to watch the game, so here's hoping some other miraculous win happens. guys so we've we lost we were winning for most of the game which i'm pretty happy about but we lost Pooey. i've been editing that video i needed to get done it's kind of turned into a mess when it comes to the color correcting part of it so frustrating yeah, it's a hot mess but like look what it was before I don't even think like this camera is doing it justice of like how like green it is on camera. Like my walls are blue, not green. It's not quite right, but <sighs> so annoying. Anyhow, I know today's vlog was short, but what can you do? Anyhow. I will see you guys tomorrow. What day is tomorrow? Wednesday. Super, super fun. Trying to decide if I should go to the gym again early in the morning, but it's like really late right now, so I don't know if that's gonna work. But who knows? We'll see.